Hello, and welcome, welcome, welcome back to another run of Darkest Dungeon. We had a fantastic time playing through the first one, and had tremendous success. Like, we've unlocked... I don't know, we got so many levels up, we unlocked so many things, and now I'm excited to try it out. I think we're going all new characters this time. We have two characters here that want to be in the front row, but I'm pretty sure they could be cool together. I don't, I don't see how we get through without a Plague Doctor, with that overpowered ability to reduce stress. I know that the Jester has similar things. What do we got? Shadowborn. If Flame is less than 50, a good chance of going stealth. Pretty cool. Very easy to you to get moved around. I don't like that. Stay hidden and evasive. Fear of cadavers and symbols of death. Gain on hit. Okay, we don't like corpses. Don't like hitting the corpses of the dead. Master of pleasures and its advantage? Or pastors. I thought it said pleasures. When damaged, there's a chance to get blinded. That's pretty bad. And head injury? Combat start, you go last. When to give what is asked of them. I mean, this is pretty cool. One second while I open up the old... What's what's going on with the channel? Let me hit comments here. So last time we had Laszlo and Ross. We've... Oh, let me... I had, I had it sort of by comments that I've already responded to. Moving through, the next person up. We've got Jesse. Did Jesse have something nice to say? Oh, Jesse was asking about more expansions in the game. All right. Well, Jesse is in. Let's looking down. We've got. All right. This is pretty great. We got your boy. Um, one sec. Who, who's going to be who here? I guess we'll just go in order. Next up, we had Kyle. This looks like a Kyle, doesn't it? Look at this Kyle. Just Kyle around. Uh, our jester is m a person who commented Matt Parker. I know, <laughs> I know that they're not the actual Matt Parker, but I love... I love that they're Matt Parker. They do a lot of uh, mathematics videos on YouTube that's just like fun maths. And I think that's just great that someone commented on that chawat. One second. I also saw a derps. And you know what? Derps has been around for so long. So maybe derps will be able to hold this channel together. Derps. All right. So... You got head injury, Jesse. You got Kyle with the head in the sand. A couple of head themes going on. Necrophobia. Matt Parker does not like dead things. And we got a sprained ankle on derps. Good luck. <laughs> Good luck, commenters. 13 leagues to the end. At least the first one's easy, right? The Valley. So, I wonder what... Like, was a beautiful place. Kyle is good in the pastures, and I need to figure out what the pastures even are. Obviously, it's one of the biomes, but I'm not sure which biome it might be. Our starting cache. Perhaps you left it for yourself. Some... A lot of bleed resist. Not here at all. Produces invigorating stew on our thing is fun. Blood resist until next end, minus stress. A lot of blood resist theme going on. I'm not sure why we need it, but Jesse, you are in the front line. We don't want you bleeding. Kyle's next. Kindred spirit, you know it. Okay, moving along. We have very little flame, but I'm sure that's about to change. Seven leagues. What's up, people? Jesse. 
you know what derps more people more people are a fan of this derps action An unexpected find. for the taking so we actually got food source 20 percent of hp that's way better than that freaking slime stuff we had been eating my word comforts are exhausted can't believe we Ahead. we accomplished what we did on the first run like i just i just can't believe it uh jesse i guess everybody wants their combat items as well now right so you do way more damage if you're below okay that's good to know jesse jesse's ready um also combat item sure you can get the speed buff and bleed resist on our jester i haven't even looked at their abilities for the record honestly you know what let's take a moment so derps we know what derps can do a lot of healing lots of stuff uh incision oh i thought oh we haven't unlocked a new ability for that class okay so the jester can move forward with a little bit of attacky tacky self back one and do a little bit cool cool okay bleed little bleed action i like that a lot um battle ballad move forward so there's a lot of movement and then requires target stress is greater than 50 you minus two stress i like it that you see, she's probably gonna be powerful is not immune to the all right let's see we're starting the battle they got a widow going on so very first thing i love ounce of prevention but in this it's an early battle so i don't think it's required let's start off with some blight action they're attacking jesse jesse's so freaking ripped man she'll screw you right up kyle is horrified right all already Oh god, I looked at the Jester's abilities and didn't even look. So, ooh, Flame is cool. I like it. So, Searing Strike is 3 to 6, and you get 2 Flame. And then Firefly is the rear position, and you do, all, you do 2 to 4, so slightly less, but more burn. Smokescreen gives you a double blind on someone. Self back run and hide you literally run backwards and hide i love it and then ignores hearthlight so we can illuminate people that are um are hiding in the dark and they have do they have decent burn resist they have 15 burn resist well good for them all right so now we're gonna go for a slice oh and awkwardly slice off is a really good move that i love but it uh, only attacks those middle two slots I could try and do a little bit more wiggling between them, like Jester keeps moving forward and backwards, and then our Kyle can do some stuff. So what do we got? We got a big halberd attack. That's gonna be solid. What is this? Iron Swan? You just freaking destroy the person who's in the back. So these are very similar. Just Wicked Hack does the front two, and then Iron Swan has to be from the front, but can get all the way to the back. Cool down. So this ignores. What is? I don't know what this blue icon is. Self something. Winded. Attack deal. Why would we want to wind ourselves? Bur Burying and yeah. I guess it. I guess it makes them weaker. But whatever. Toe to toe, is forward immobilized. Oh, okay, and you taunt. Well. I think we just hack away. So four to seven damage. We'll make sure that this guy dies. Kyle. Kyle's gonna try again to get some burn going. So that should kill him. Toe to toe. I mean, I guess we can go for a kill. So our jester does not like hitting this because it's a corpse. So Razor's Wit moves forward. 
and we get a little bit of dodge, which is cool. Preventative medicine, don't need. I think we go for the blind. So now you have less chance to hit us. Gruesome reflection, big miss, big miss. And then... Huh. Yeah, I mean, this is good. I think we might even want our Jester in front of Kyle. I mean, all these people have such great movement abilities. I think Jesse wants to be in the front line no matter what. So we'll give her the ability to stay there a little bit. Um, Derps already has the ability to heal people that are bleeding. Okay, well, Kyle, you can go there. How do I, um, there we go. So I just put Kyle behind Matt Parker. <laughs> Matt Parker, I love it. Um, and then we want to put this on our thing as soon as possible. All right, we've already got a little bit of stress. Did we not get a, um, okay, we did get a mastery. You always, you always get a mastery for the first run. Now, you know I want to put it on derps and just do ounce of prevention to manage our stress levels out the gate. I might do that. I feel like it could be a lame way forward, but people became more friendly. Reach the crown. Heal 100%. Very good. So everyone's full health. Jesse's freaking tank. We have the health, too. I guess the Jester doesn't have that much health. What, do, what is your ability that moves you backwards? It is an attack. Okay. So let's... Alright, let's look at the Provisioner. Precious relics remind us of a time before the end. I mean, this is all fine. I guess, like, the gloves are pretty good. Because we have... We have two people with stress. So Kyle and... And Jesse could go boxing. For wealth no longer has meaning. And we could buy some trinket stuff as well. Very large blight attack. That's pretty cool, actually. But no, let's buy the, the gloves. And then... Jesse has a head injury. I see. Who do you have relationships with? You're neutral all around. Well, you and... You, actually, I should have given it, because I think that actually comes with plus five damage, I should have given that to Matt Parker. He should have been part of that boxing crew. But that's fine. We're learning. We're learning. So, so just more damage, more damage. The Barbarian, yeah, is, is fine, but it, it, I don't like winding ourselves. If it bleeds... Okay, so you do want to be in the second row for this. Toe-to-toe. -to -toe. I mean, this is, is fine. But I, I'm not sold on the masteries for you. Uh, I mean, this gives combo, which is going to be a big deal later on, I have no doubt. This also gives combo... And this is actually what I want to start with earlier. Fade to black. So this is going to be a big one I want to level up. Slice off is powerful. And would leave exposed. Forward one. Gain attack. 15% chance for the crit. Remove that. That's fine. This removes three stress and horror. This is, this is quite the ability. And then finally, we're starting you in the second row. So you don't even have access to smoke screen from there. I guess hide and run doesn't make sense for you. Oh, so this heals you when you do it. Very fun. This puts way more blind and more um, more combo. Five burn. Random adjacent monster when you have combo. Okay, so there's obvious... And this is also random adjacent. So we want to do a combo squad... And then have Kyle light up the night. I have no doubt. But for the start, we're going ounce of prevention because it's just OP. It's like a it's a must take. You know. 
And then invigorating stew. We're gonna make stew. Don't know how often we're gonna make stew. So the sprawl and the triangle. So like are either of these pastors? Three resistance encounters for a ton of hope. Avoid the hospital for plus two mastery points, I think is where we want to go. Resignation and death. Because that'll give us a ton of mastery points. And then from there, what we'll do is we'll get all those combos going and then have Kyle light up the freaking night, man. DPS hard. Um, where Jesse's just going to be chilling. Oh, God. I think they want us to do an academic study. Let's see. What do we got here? So we do not want to go to the hospital. But we do like assistance. Oh wait, that's that's cultist. I think that we want to go right path. It's short term, not great. Because we don't need to fight a cultist, but... It's fine, it's fine. I really wanted the academic study. One thing that we're not going to hide from at all is the bell. We really want to progress our hero stories. Matt Parker and Derps are having a good time chatting away. Yeah, we really want to get those better... There's so many things that could be better, basically. So, we want to level up our heroes. Because I'm pretty sure it unlocks their abilities permanently. And everything else on the run is just temporary for that run. So, Alright, attack, run away, run away. Y'all scared, man. Kyle knows what's up. Kyle's like, let's go. Though I did put him an extra round back. Okay, this um, this is not good. They put us in a really bad place, and everyone's pissed off and afraid. Um, We can run and hide you back. Hearthlight, no, we got a Firefly. They've got amazing dodge chance right now. So let's just go and put it on one of these guys. Okay. That missed. If it bleeds. I think we go toe to toe because that sends us forward. And that brings our healer a little bit further back, which is what we're looking to do. And then if we send our jester forward... Our healer will come even further back, and we're good. Oh, look at that bleed resist. Very good. So, this is back. This is forward. Razor's wit. Good. Good little bit of damage. And then finally, ounce of prevention. And bring down that stress. I love it. We freaking nailed it. And then, ounce of prevention gives you all of the resistances, man. I'm telling you, it's so good. People people don't love resistances because they're not flashy, but I was down for it before I got minus one stress on my whole party. If it gave me minus two on one person, I'd still use it a lot. Um, we are immobilized and weak. We can iron swan. But I think we just want to focus one of these tall boys down. We could incision... I think we want a blinding gas, though. They both got their dodges off, which is fine. I actually wanted to get through their dodges because now we have a good chance um, to do the dirty. Okay, we're blinded and everything up front here. Ooh, bring this one down, Legolas. We're already in a sketchy place. How much bleed resistance do you have? 45. How much do I have with Matt Parker? It might be worth using our frickin' Clodden powder here. Just stay alive. Don't let it get to us. Oh, he's got the dodge on. Oh, but we hit through it and got the bleed. That's sick. Okay, come on. Six damage. Great. Now we got all this burn going. Honestly, having Matt in the, or Kyle in the back is not too bad either. Um, I 
A lot of these move our character other than slice off, but if we do slice off here, it'll put you on death's door. Oh my god, it didn't because of our weak. Oh gosh darn, I should have looked. Though look at that, they tried to put bleed on both of us, and now we're fine. Okay, this is actually a little bit scary. Let's take some stimulants. And we have blind, and they have a super dodge, so let's just try and waste everything. So now our blind is gone, their dodge is gone. We have battlefield medicine. Let's get an incision going, start the bleed on this one. All right, they're happy about it. And let's get some firefly. We can't hit them, but I guess we hit the, the back line here. So death store. They do less damage because of it. We are bleeding. They are burning. Leave my Kyle alone. And then, yeah, once we have the combos and then the combo flame spreaders, we're going to be so freaking on it, man. Um, let's go for Iron Swan again. Try and take out this back line guy. It's an interesting ability. You have to be in front row. They have to be in rear row. Okay, that's sketchy. I don't know how we got this block, but I'm for it. Okay, good dodge from them. Oh, almost stuttered there. Yeah, this horror is really bad, but I, I could get rid of it if I buff the Jester to having the one of those abilities. Oh, we have a bandage? Okay, well, we'll use it then. And then... Boom! Big crit! And with the burn, you are so dead. So there's the death blow. This guy's a bit scary, frontliner, but... Toe to toe. Big dodge, okay. We got the taunt off, though, so we're just causing them, forcing them to fight us here. Uh, we'll cut this one up so it starts bleeding. It resisted. Ooh, the crit. Don't like that. A lot of stress going around. And then weakness. That's fine. The horror's finally done, and now we have Battlefield Medicine to bring our front line back to life. We're not going to run and hide. Instead, we're going to miss so bad, but that's fine. Hmm. A lot of blinds coming our way. A lot of blinds, but we can keep Battlefield Medicine going. We do have a taunt still, right? No, we have Immobile. Still. Keep hacking. And we need to get some DOT going on this guy here. But he just keeps resisting. I cannot seem to hit him. There we go. A crit and a burn. Break apart some of their animosity. Okay, this guy's got to go down. And he's got a lot of health. And he's now got a dodge. So that's very unlikely. He's going to die next time he takes an action, though, because he has, still has three burn on him. So we're going to do what we have to to take this one out. Oh, we could remove our stress, though. And if, even if we're low, at least we're happy because we're not stressed out, you know? So if it bleeds... Oh, if it bleeds, hits the center targets. See, just I'm really struggling to hit the front line. Is is kind of where we're weakest right now. Our jester's just so mobile, and right now I have no way of getting Kyle to target the front line without just rotating forward. He's got to stay center. Going to rear rank is bad because we don't have a way of pushing forward on it. Uh, fading back is good. I love that. And that adds a blind, which is just sick. Can't Firefly. Can't Hearthlight. See, like, how weak this is? Like, because this one unit that I can target is already burning, there's no sense wasting actions going for it. Get a last little heal, because we're very close to through this combat, even though it looks bad. 
Good chance to miss here, but we still got it. Die. There it is. Yeah, I really like the Jester's mobility. Whoa, Dark Impulse. 40% max HP. I think that goes front line. I think that's a Jesse kind of thing. Because Jesse gets massive bonuses if Jesse's below 50% and 25. So if you can get the max HP very high, then we're freaking popping. Just a little one one health too much right now. But one and two. And now I don't it doesn't light up, but look at that. So at 30 health we get a 25% bonus and at 15 health we get a 50% bonus I'm into that now Kyle you cannot get pushed around or we'll lose you you can't get bled everyone's a little happy everyone's fine we got basically no items that we can use right now we can't go to the hospital as part of our mission It'll get us two bonus masteries when we get to the end of the line here. So that's no doubt going to pay off massively for us. Oh, okay. These, these guys are a bit sketchy. But maybe... I feel like fire should be so good against them. They have good bleed resistance, though. But we'll try. We'll try for it. Okay, bleed's good. We'll reduce our stress and get all of our preventions up. So we're not likely to bleed now. I mean, geez, right? With the plus 15, it's 30 base plus 15. Then you've got the trinket for plus 20 and then another 15. So your 20 goes all the way up to 55. Like, look at these sick resistances, man. They're sick. Freaking sick. Firefly. Burn. Yeah, baby. Burn, baby, burn. So in two turns, you're dead. So I'm going to start going into Iron Swan territory and hitting the rear rank. See, one more turn of that, and he's gone. Ooh, that's an ouchy move. But you're below half, so I think I can Battlefield Medicine you quite well. We need, like, an AoE to, like, break through when they have all these blocks and guards and stuff. Ooh. I mean, I mean that's not great. Try and get through, slicing through. They resisted the bleed. That's fine. We're going in for the swan dive. Wish we had like a. Well, I wish I had a couple of things. Bandages. That's huge. Keep our people alive here. And then firefly back row. Let's go, Kyle. Big kills, big kills. Uh, bringing this, yeah, we gotta bring Jesse back. Jesse's going down. There's the burn. Okay, okay. Ooh, these crits are massive. Okay, we're going down fast here. But burn, we're getting through their guards. Oh, I guess the guards are just less damage, so. Things like the DOTs, damage over times, are going to still just pop off. Uh, if we go for a hack on you, I think that means that you die at the start of your next turn, which is fantastic news. Let's keep our front line healthy, because she's very likely to do more taunts. Oh, you're a death store kind of guy. I see how it is. Your death store defense is 5%. So I have to take the assumption that that's not going to work. So see here, now we do a fade back with our jester, and all of a sudden Kyle's in on the front line. Like, it's just that one little swamp is all you need to kind of activate the squad. We do a little sprinkling of de-stressing. And hacking away. I could have done stand toe-to-toe -to, -toe to taunt. Probably should have, in fact. But look at that dodge chance, bro. There's the death blow. 
Round five. Can we do it? Fade back. Five damage. Looking good. Death door, and now we got blight and burn on you. And let's end it. Great job, Kyle. But effective. And now we're happy with each other because we're so de-stressed. Well Buffs, flame resist. That's so like lame. Like we don't care. Um. But I guess we'll take Blight Resist on our boy. On our boy, Jester. Because we are putting him front and center. Um, and then for combat stuff, sure. You're the Flame Lord, Kyle. So we'll give you the ability to Flame Lord someone else. Or at least give them defense from the Flame. I think we want to keep our Flame high. Especially if we can get a lot of good loot in the process. I mean, they're going to like each other no matter what, so let's just keep the love going. Explosive. Produces whiskey. Ooh, baby. And I think we also got laudanum, which is fantastic. So, what's this? Days an enemy, chance to stun. That's pretty solid. And then laudanum with our healer. Derps. With derps. I think we're rather we're not ready. We don't care for the bar hoarder because we don't have any baubles to go with our relics. So I think that we're gonna go for the unknown here. We don't have we're not looking for a battle because we don't have any loathing against us right now. But we'll see what we come across. Is that a roadblock coming up? It sure looks like one. Ah, uh, it's just a little one. Looks like we're gonna get through. Forgotten Outpost. That's definitely a battle. We don't have to take this battle. We don't have to take this battle. We have no loathing to reduce. Let's get out of here, man. Hopeful. Yo, alright. Jesse and Derps sitting in a tree. Hopeful. I don't know what hopeful is gonna give. Whoa, we're not. Oh. No, no. I didn't want to go to the hoarder. I just. Do you see that? Onward, while there is oh. time. Man, I did not want to go this way. I don't know what's there, but it could have been a bell. Could have been a bell tower. I guess it's a better road. It's not this cobble path. Oh, what is that, a cannon? A lot of cannons. But yeah, this is not the direction I wanted. I specifically went to that last battle just to get away from this guy. Ah, <sighs> stitching kit heals a lot. I mean, the playing cards is great. It's a really good item. Whoa, crow's nest. These are kind of cool too, eh? Produces concoction, stone mount, lots of beautiful things, buffs, resistance. I mean, like, it's all fine. I guess the only thing I really care for is the playing cards. Maybe the stitching kit, but we're doing so well on all these things. I like the clotting poultice. Uh, we already have one, but you know what? That's fine. Look, we'll, we'll, we're here. We're going to get some benefit out of it. And hey, look, we got a hero shrine after all. We did get a bell. Lucky us. And then there's another bell potential afterwards. So this worked out for us. Made me happier than going to this battle here. Um, I think... Kyle is kind of our lord right now. Our lord and savior Kyle has really got a lot going on. Though Bodic like our our Jesse really could stand to use some better right or some better abilities as well. Cuz Kyle's already kind of good. I just want a manipulation to send Kyle forward by his own right. So let's see. Run away. 
Chapter 1 The Pigs of St. Martha's Good luck, Kyle. <laughs> Good luck with your backstory, bro. Oh! Her pious caretakers had marked her for the last time. Oh, Tonight, God. She would escape their cruelty at last. Hide. Pickpocket. Yo, okay. Okay. Let's get a little closer then. We have to get the key to get out of here, bruh. Sure, let's let's hide. Oh, we can't move yet. Where are you looking next, lady? I gotta get through this one. Oh, but they're already looking where we are. Oh, uh oh. When I hid, I uh Oh we're good. They looked at the wrong one. Oh my god, we're gonna get through this. We're gonna ace it. Let's go. We're so close. Search the back row, lady. Okay, let's pass. Okay. I guess we have to do a hide now. Because we really don't want to get caught. Okay, it looks like they searched the front one. But see, now I'm immobile. So I don't know what... Like, you kind of screw yourself over with the hide. Oh, because we got the dodge. Not this one. Come on. I don't know how strong their attack is, right? Like, I guess we'll try another hide here. Okay, they found us. And now this is really scary. Because if they search for us again... Okay, they did not. So we can get a pass on here. Oh, they keep trying it. And the thing is here, look, I'm going to hide so that I get a dodge chance. I'm not sure. Like, she might kill you in one hit, right? I don't know. So that means I have to wait here for a turn. So don't search here. Okay, she might. She might not. She might search the back row. So we pass. Yo. All right. So now we have our dodge chance token. And we can run forward. And they're not even searching the front row. We're through, baby. We are so through. Show yourself. I'm not doing it, man. I'm not doing it. We're pickpocketing. And away we go, baby. Several locks of the orphanage door, baby. Let's go. We have to do it again? Steal three keys. Okay, so it probably doesn't kill you in one hit. Probably not at all. But we have no way to heal, so this is fine. Three keys, though? Oh, my God. You can probably be very bold. I doubt she does that much damage, and it's always a 50-50 on whether they'll hit you. But I, uh, you know, the, the gamer in me is like, bruh, why you don't, don't charge forward if you can perfect it? tiptoe forward so we did lose our our hide there and now here is our first hit okay i mean it was only three damage like i literally thought we could die to one hit here i mean we'll do a pass just in case because look at that uh don't search the front stop searching the front bro do another pass I'm just search in the front row they know i'm getting closer she knows i'm on it Okay, now they're searching both anyway, so tiptoe forward. Unlucky, unlucky. But you kind of have to take a hit when you get close at this point. This is a little sketchy, is when you you pick pocket. You know what, we'll pass, because they might search back row. We don't want to be searched when we get back there. 
show yourself right here. Back three is perfect. Thank you. Goodbye. We got key number two. Get ready for it. Search and fort. It's interesting. Like I love what they do with these backstories. Because some of them are just like a chat. Like, ooh, this, that, the other. But here, like, we're actually like doing interesting game mechanics and puzzles. Like when we had to lead that failed assault and we kept trying to do commands and failing with the uh, man at arms, like that to me was such immersive storytelling in a, a cool way um, where no matter how hard you try, everything's kind of going wrong and awful and you're getting overcome with stress. And like here, we're literally trying to sneak out of our orphanage because we're a runaway, right? Love it. Self forward pull one. That's exactly what I wanted. I love it. I love it. All right, Kyle, get over here. Combat skills. So we want both your flames, searing strike and firefly. Smoke screen is fine. Hide is important. Hearth light is fine but it does the whole enemy squad I mean two blinds is pretty good but it's from a position I don't plan on standing in I'm kind of making Kyle a third row uh, Marty relationships hopeful all right very happy with that how that turned out at least it should be. We want this bell next, and we can avoid a couple of fights because we have no loathing. So we're going right. Our squad's quite healthy too. Perhaps you are finding your courage at last. <laughs> These seasoned soldiers People were, deployed were loving to the it. Front, meant to prevent the cult's descent from the mountain. Why deployed on a winding front? Okay, this cannon is always tricky. Combo. Hopeful, let's go. So, I think we're going to start with our prevention. Keep the keep the cooler, cooler heads, right? It's basically just like a cheerleader. A little bit longer. Yo, huge heal. All right, chance to stun. Didn't get it. Didn't get it. But iron swan time. Oh, big crit, big crit. So then with a little bit of a firefly, three and then three, baby, that's enough. And now we need Kyle to be able to hit the front row. So we're gonna fade back, apply a little blind on our boy. Death blow in the back. Okay, we're getting really framey here. You can't even burn the cannon. I don't know how I'm going to do this. But this actually would have been a good time to blind. Have that smoke screen that I literally just threw out. So forward, back. The only t way to attack that doesn't screw with us is this. Well, forward we go. And see, this is why I needed Kyle to have an ability to push himself forward. Because, I mean, now we're here, right? Alright, Iron Swan. I can hit the back rank from where I am, but we got to get through a lot of these things. Let's get a blind down range, please. Resist, not good. Misfire, yo, ho, 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 baby. That does not happen often. All right, so Iron Swan, good stuff, pushing forward. Razor's Wit, let's go. Uh, we'll do a Noxus Blast on one of these just to start chewing away. Ransack does a pull, which is interesting. But no, we want Firefly right now. Two to four damage. Three to six damage. 
I guess the burn is literally not going to happen, so we may as well go in for a ransack. Got a lot of ways to go here. Long ways to go. A lot of block. So fade back. That should blind. Yes, and we got it that time. We don't even need to reduce stress. Like, we are literally not stressed. That is, like, amazing. All right. If it bleeds, it does not bleed. Toe. All right. So we're going to do toe to toe, which is forward one. I don't know how, but Kyle ended up absolutely front rank. Does this Is this forward two? No, it's forward one. Three to six or three to six? I mean... I guess we'll pull you forward. Boom. Oh, baby. Can we... Do we have a charge forward? Toe to toe? So does that not push us because we're mobile? Good. Well, not good, but cool. What ha what I expected to happen, happen. Try and get rid of some of that. So even run and hide, I don't think is enough back that you would get to back properly. Kyle's a killer, man. And Razor's wit forward. And that actually worked, okay. I will be your blade. Oh, they like that a lot. Load shot. All of my units basically have a forward movement attack thing. Oh, look, and that... It's working around the immobile. Big old death blow. Let's go. The means of mastery. Oh, that's the thing is... We should really be taking the battles, I think. Because... Um, more mastery and stuff. So I might think twice before retreating from the next one. Okay, Derps already has a really bad chance from their quirk to not be moved, but I thought Kyle was the one that we didn't want moved, but now that Kyle has the ability to do whatever they want, Derps is gonna have to be that person that resists movement, because we want Derps in the absolute rear rank all the time because that gives us so much flexibility with our front three oh, it brings no satisfaction so here it's battle battle run no man kyle's kyle's a killer now he sees a bunch of trees a bunch of plants he's like we got it they are so dead uh, we don't even need an ounce of prevention i mean we probably should anyway but Hopeful, yo. So does that get rid of more block? Yeah, got rid of both the block because they both attacked. And it applied a bleed? Okay, we need to start putting some damage on this bad boy because we know he can bring things back to life. And we have a DOT. Oh my god. So much damage. Uh, Firefly, please. Like, we're using Blight, Bleed, and Fire. This is such a DOT team. And that's why it's so hard for us to kill the cannon. Because the cannon is... Literally, you can only destroy it with, like, physical attacks. Okay. Okay. So, getting you a little bit more damage should bring you... a oh, one away from dead next turn. Let's stack some more fire on you. Resist. So, though you're dead next turn. Oh, I think this this guy actually has a death store. Death defiance or whatever. Ooh. Every disease has a vaccine? Okay, well, we're hopeful. Then you're going to survive next round without a little bit of... A little bit of help. So that was good. Hmm. Death's blow, what? <laughs> Did not expect that. That must that was a good crit. And I thought he would have Death's Door, but I guess he didn't. I mean it clearly he didn't. Alright, ounce of prevention. Stay calm. I know we could have taken that chance to heal, but I'm more interested 
and in cultivating a healthy working environment at the office than I am at my people not dying. I mean, they'll, they'll get better. They'll, get, they'll be fine. So now Kyle's in the correct spot to keep up the torching because we've actually pushed others back. Kyle gets healed because Kyle's the hero of the story. This is the Kyle story. And we're going to build up our squad to combo and spread fire because Kyle in this particular story is also a pyromaniac. And we love it. Death store, baby. Let's go. And then dashing back forward because our jester's hilarious like that. Ugh, man, so good. Plus two speed, not bad. Bugle. I'm not sure that I want anyone other than our barbarian to take the heat. Right? Like, Jesse already has both the items used up. Kyle could be the one for that. I don't, I don't think that's what we want. I think that if anything, who can set up combos? No one yet, but I bet you it's gonna be Matt in the Matt Parker in the future. Who needs the speed? Well, for now it's gonna be it's gonna be our boy Kyle. Kyle is like putting down so much damage over time, though. Oh, look at this! We're all happy. Well, except for Matt Parker, who's sad. A roadblock and honestly that's enough for this episode i hope you enjoyed and we're gonna meet you in the next one to see how this battle goes